showing 99 degrees right now on the scoreboard as we're looking there, but it is very, very hot out here today. And we are underway here at the lab. It's Meow Wolf Night, a historic first time meeting between Pittsburgh Riverhounds and New Mexico United. But I got to say, we, we've had a chance to see the kits up close and a thing of beauty. Yeah, they're pretty special this year. You've got to say they are pretty special. Nico Brett finds Kiesewetter in space. Here's Jerome Kiesewetter, and Kiesewetter hits open the scoring. Less than a minute in, Jerome Kiesewetter, he's been in form, and he keeps it rolling. And the 12,000 fans here at the lab, Chris, have erupted. Uh, what a start. I mean, Scoring his second on the season, and you can see there, just goes corner pocket as Waite did everything he could. It's been a tough stretch of games here for uh, New Mexico and I see a lot and you know some of it squad rotation picking up a couple of injuries. Griffin unleashes one saved by Tambakis and it's tapped in but no the offside flag is up on the near side. A little slack with possession in midfield what a save by Tambakis and yeah uh, the one person you do not want the ball popping out to in that situation and you could hear the collective holding of breath from everyone in the stadium. Um, and it looked like Sawahi was a little deep there. I think that's uh, that's the question Ciceroni is asking right now is, did Sawahi keep him on there? But the call was the call. Dixon looking for the through ball. Dixon's free. And Dixon rifles it across the face of goal. Here's Nico Brett. Connects with Swartz. Here's Suggs now. Suggs unleashes one. I didn't want to say this, but it is a very similar trend in the way that the game's going to the, the last home game against RGV, where Mexico United just getting deeper and deeper. That back three really has become a back five now. Lots of crosses coming into the box. And here's Kelly on his way through. And you said it, Chris. Dane Kelly... Notches his seventh goal of the season and the USL Championships all-time leading goal scorer furthers his mark. Gonna go again, give it away in possession there and Kelly just so, so quick off the shoulder of Kaelin Ryan. Before Kaelin Ryan he had, even has a chance to react, he's already in and he's already stroking it past 10 backers. Doesn't even need a touch, just one touch, pops it in there. Yeah, and, and, and that's all the opportunity D Dane Kelly needs. Ibarra, Kelly gets ahead on it, and that was close. Tambakis watched it go by his goalpost, and that's the full-time whistle here at the lab.